This is a Jasper Elite. Has the cool runner installed with the capacitor mod. I put two 68 UF, which are exactly the same as 68 NF capacitors, on the ground and CPU PLL bypass. So let's take a look. Generally, it boots within 30 seconds. Note that it did not boot at all without the capacitors. So as you can see it did take a while to uh, to boot or glitch. So what I'm going to do really quick is on the CPU RST which is the blue wire right here I'm going to put another uh, 68 UF aka 68 NF capacitor um, on the cool runner pad and then onto the wire and see how much faster it boots. Uh, once I've done that I will be right back. Okay, uh, as you can see I have the 68 UF, aka 68 NF, uh, capacitor from the cool runner pad to the wire. Uh, this is just a test so I didn't uh, do a permanent install. So let's take a look. Now look at that. It was at about 4 seconds. Let's try it again. I have not tested the um, CPU RST capacitor uh, mod before. This is the first time I've done it. Um, so, second boot looks a little bit longer. Let's try another boot. So it's um, still a little slow, but it boots within 30 seconds. Um, on average, I'd say that's acceptable. Not sure I want to put two caps on the uh, RST or not, but uh, one cap on there is good. Two caps on the ground and uh, PLL bypass, and uh, I think you'll be good to go.